Did you know that Belarus is often referred to as Europe's last dictatorship? Intrigued? Let's dive in. Nestled in the heart of Europe, Belarus is a mystery waiting to be unraveled. Bordered by Russia to the east, Ukraine to the south, Poland to the west, and Lithuania and Latvia to the northwest, this landlocked nation is a fascinating blend of cultures and histories. Now that we know where to locate Belarus on a map, let's delve into its rich and tumultuous history. Belarus has a history that stretches back to the early medieval times. Let's take a step back in time, to the 9th century, when the region was known as Kievan Rus, a federation of Slavic tribes under the rule of the Varangians. The Mongols invaded in the 13th century, leading to the formation of the Grand Duchy of Lithuania, which included present-day Belarus. The duchy later merged with Poland in the 14th century, forming a large multinational state known as the Polish-Lithuanian Commonwealth. Fast forward to the late 18th century, the Commonwealth was partitioned by its neighbors, Russia, Prussia, and Austria. Most of Belarus fell under the Russian Empire, marking a period of significant cultural and linguistic Russification. The early 20th century brought waves of change. Following the Bolshevik Revolution in Russia and the end of World War I, Belarus declared independence in 1919 as the Belarusian People's Republic. However, the independence was short-lived as the country was soon absorbed by Soviet Russia. During World War II, Belarus suffered immense destruction and loss. It was one of the most devastated regions, with a third of its population perished, and more than half of its economic resources obliterated. Post-war, Belarus became one of the founding members of the United Nations and the Union of Soviet Socialist Republics, or the USSR. During this period, Belarus underwent extensive industrialization and urbanization. The dissolution of the Soviet Union in 1991 marked the birth of the Republic of Belarus. In the years that followed, the country experienced economic hardships, political controversies, and an ongoing struggle to establish a democratic governance. Despite the trials, Belarus has shown resilience. The country has managed to maintain a strong industrial base and has made strides in the technology sector. It has also preserved its unique Belarusian culture, with the Belarusian language, folk music, and dance playing a significant role in society. Despite its turbulent history, Belarus has managed to preserve its unique culture and traditions, which are integral to daily life. The past may have shaped Belarus, but it's the spirit of the people that continues to define its future. Imagine waking up to the sight of pristine lakes, vast forests, and historic architecture. That's a regular day in Belarus. Diving into the daily life in Belarus, one cannot overlook the importance of food. Belarusian cuisine is a hearty affair, influenced by the country's rich farming traditions. Whether it's the comforting draniki, potato pancakes often served with sour cream, or the traditional kolduni, dumplings filled with meat or mushrooms, you're sure to find a dish that warms the soul. And let's not forget kvass, a fermented beverage made from rye bread, a staple quencher on a hot summer day. Language is also a vital part of Belarusian life. While Belarusian and Russian are both official languages, you'll find that Russian is more commonly spoken in urban areas. Belarusian, however, is experiencing a resurgence, particularly among the younger generation who are keen to preserve their linguistic heritage. The culture of Belarus is deeply rooted in its history and traditions. It's a place where the old meets the new and where folk customs are still cherished. You'll find this fusion in their music, literature and arts. The Belarusians celebrate numerous holidays throughout the year, with Maslanitsa, a week-long festival marking the end of winter, and Kupale, a Midsummer Night's festivity, being amongst the most vibrant. Belarusians are known for their hospitality and respect for traditions. Family is the cornerstone of society here, with many generations often living under one roof. It's not uncommon to see locals spending their free time at Dakas, countryside houses, where they garden, fish, and barbecue during the warmer months. Belarus is also a nation of sport lovers, with ice hockey and football being the favorites. But it's not all about competition. Belarusians also love their tranquil walks in the park, their bike rides along the river, 
or their weekend trips to the forest to forage for mushrooms, a beloved national pastime. Now that we have a glimpse of daily life in Belarus, let's look at the cost of living. Living in Belarus can be quite affordable compared to Western European countries. One of the factors that makes Belarus a compelling destination is its cost of living. If you've got your sights set on this Eastern European gem, you're in for a pleasant surprise when it comes to your wallet. Start with the basics, food, a loaf of bread. You can pick one up for less than half a euro. A liter of milk? Well, that will cost you a mere 50 cents or so. Eating out is also quite reasonable. A meal at an inexpensive restaurant will cost you around five euros, while a three-course dinner at a mid-range restaurant for two people averages around 25 euros. What about transportation? Public transport in Belarus is incredibly affordable. A one-way ticket on local transport will set you back just 25 cents. If you prefer driving, petrol costs around 75 cents per liter. Now, let's talk about housing. Whether you're planning to rent or buy, prices are significantly lower than in many other European countries. On average, monthly rent for a one-bedroom apartment in the city center is around 300 euros. If you prefer a bit more space and don't mind a commute, a three-bedroom apartment outside the city center costs around the same. Utilities? They're usually around 50 euros a month, including heating, cooling, water, and garbage. Internet, another essential in today's world, averages around 10 euros a month for unlimited data. And what about entertainment? A cinema ticket will cost you around 4 euros, and a monthly gym membership is about 20 euros. So, whether you're planning to work, study, or retire in Belarus, your living expenses will be quite manageable. This affordability doesn't mean you have to compromise on quality of life. On the contrary, you can enjoy a comfortable lifestyle and still have money left over for adventures. Affordable living in Belarus leaves room for some fun when the sun goes down. With the cost of living so reasonable, you'll have plenty of opportunities to explore all that Belarus has to offer. Belarus might be quiet by day, but it comes alive at night. The nightlife scene in Belarus is an electrifying blend of local charm and modern energy. It's not just about popular bars and clubs, there's something for everyone. In the heart of the city, you'll find a vibrant mix of live music venues, from homegrown rock and folk to international pop and jazz. For those who prefer a more relaxed vibe, there are numerous cozy pubs where you can enjoy a pint of local beer or a glass of Belarusian horilka. If you're after a more sophisticated experience, the capital, Minsk, boasts an array of high-end cocktail bars and lounges. And for the party-goers, the city's dance clubs throb with energy until the early morning hours, offering everything from techno to hip-hop. Belarus also takes pride in its cultural offerings with a rich calendar of theater, ballet, and opera performances that can make for an elegant night out. But there's more to Belarus than its nightlife. Let's explore its people. Belarusians are known for their beauty, especially their women. You'll find the people here blessed with distinctive Slavic features, often characterized by light skin tones high cheekbones and captivating eyes, ranging from cool blues to warm browns. But their allure isn't just skin deep. Belarusians are a warm, welcoming lot, with a knack for making you feel right at home. They are deeply rooted in their culture, a fact that shines through in their love for traditional music, dance, and cuisine. Don't be surprised if you're invited to a local's home for a hearty meal of draniki and borscht. It's this hospitality that truly sets them apart. They're also known for their resilience and strength, having weathered many a storm throughout history. They are proud, they are persistent, but above all, they are kind. To know Belarus, you must truly know its people. Now that we know the people, let's prepare for a visit. Belarus is a country that welcomes visitors with open arms. Nestled in Eastern Europe, this gem of a nation is a treasure trove of culture, history, and scenic beauty. But before you pack your bags and set off on an adventure, there are a few things you must know. Firstly, visa requirements. Belarus has a visa-free regime for citizens of 80 countries for stays up to 30 days. However, this only applies if you enter and exit through Minsk National Airport. 
For other entries or longer stays, you'll need a visa, so check your country's specific requirements. Next, health precautions. While Belarus is generally a safe destination, travelers are advised to be up to date with routine vaccinations. These may include measles, mumps, rubella, diphtheria, tetanus, and pertussis. Additionally, a few other vaccines like hepatitis A and B and tick-borne encephalitis might be recommended based on your travel plans. Now let's talk about some travel tips. Belarusians are hospitable and friendly. Don't hesitate to strike up a conversation with locals and learn more about their customs. The official languages are Belarusian and Russian, so knowing a few phrases in either language can be helpful. The local currency is the Belarusian ruble, and while credit cards are widely accepted, it's always handy to have some cash. Finally, remember, each journey is unique, and the real joy of travel is in the unexpected surprises along the way. So stay open, stay curious, and embrace the adventure. With the travel guide handy, let's explore the must-visit places in Belarus. Belarus is a treasure trove of architectural wonders and natural beauty. Nestled in Eastern Europe, this nation boasts a plethora of must-visit destinations. From the vibrant capital city of Minsk, with its Soviet-era architecture, to the historic city of Brest, home to the Brest Fortress, a monument to the city's resilience during World War II. For nature enthusiasts, the primeval Białowieża forest shared with Poland is a UNESCO World Heritage Site and a sanctuary for European bison. Equally captivating is the Braslaw Lakes, a complex of more than 30 lakes, offering a paradise for bird watchers and anglers alike. For a taste of Belarusian culture, the city of Grodno, with its well-preserved medieval architecture and the grandiose new castle, is a must-see. And let's not forget the Mir Castle Complex, another UNESCO site, which is a fascinating fusion of Gothic, Renaissance and Baroque architecture. Before we wrap up, let's take a peek into the Belarusian education and health system. Belarus prides itself on its robust education and health system. Education is a priority with a literacy rate near 100%. The system follows a comprehensive approach starting from primary school through to university, emphasizing both academic and vocational training. Universities in Belarus are globally recognized, with many international students choosing to study here. As for healthcare, Free medical services are provided to all citizens and residents. The country has a well-developed network of hospitals and clinics, with a focus on preventive care. However, like any other system, it's not without its challenges. These include a need for modernization and a more patient-centric approach. In terms of improvement, efforts are underway to digitalize the education and health system, bringing it up to speed with global standards. Belarus is indeed a testament to the power of prioritizing human development. We hope you've enjoyed this comprehensive guide to Belarus. From its enigmatic aura to its historical chronicles, from living the Belarusian life to the affordable cost of living, from its lively nightlife to its charming people, we've covered it all. And of course, we've also touched upon the easy travel options, must-visit places, and the robust education and health system. Belarus is not just a country, it's an experience, it's a feeling. It's the warmth of its people, the richness of its history, and the allure of its landscapes. We encourage you to visit Belarus and experience its unique culture and history firsthand. If you've learned something about Belarus and want to be notified of future videos, please like and subscribe to support our channel. Your support helps us create more content like this. As always, thank you for watching, and we hope to see you in the next video. Until then, safe travels.